Can women experience multiple types of orgasms? What is the relationship between self-esteem and sexual desire? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Yes, women can experience multiple types of orgasms, such as clitoral, vaginal, and mixed orgasms. Orgasmic experiences vary based on stimulation and individual response. Self-esteem can influence sexual desire. Positive self-esteem can increase confidence and interest in intimacy, while low self-esteem can negatively impact sexual desire. Japanese sex culture, Japan has a unique sexual culture that includes practices such as kawaii, cute, and wabi-sabi, the beauty of imperfection. It is also known for its adult entertainment industry. Kegel exercises. Kegel exercises are not only for women. Men can also benefit from strengthening the pelvic floor muscles to improve the quality of their orgasms and control ejaculation. Love and sexual desire. Romantic love and sexual desire are two different aspects of a relationship. While love focuses on emotional connection, sexual desire involves physical attraction. Masturbation. Masturbation is a common way for both men and women to experience orgasms. It is a healthy practice that can help individuals learn about their bodies and sexual preferences. Mental preparation. Mental preparation is crucial for a positive experience. Open communication and trust between partners can significantly contribute to emotional comfort. Multiple orgasms in women. Some women can experience multiple orgasms in a single sexual session. This can result from continuous stimulation and the ability to have several orgasms in a short period. National Condom Day. In some countries, National Condom Day is celebrated to promote awareness of the importance of condom use in preventing sexually transmitted diseases and unwanted pregnancies. Orgasm and pregnancy. Female orgasms may have a positive effect on pregnancy. Some research suggests that orgasms may increase the chances of conception, possibly due to contractions aiding sperm movement. Orgasms and menopause. Some women experience an increase in the frequency and intensity of orgasms after menopause, as hormonal changes can positively impact sexual function. Oxytocin and emotional bonding. Oxytocin, known as the love hormone or cuddle hormone, is released during sex and orgasm. It plays a crucial role in the emotional bond between partners. Pelvic floor training. Both men and women can benefit from pelvic floor training to enhance the intensity and control of their orgasms. Exercises like Kegel exercises can strengthen the muscles involved in the sexual response. Physical build. Some women may find different types of physique attractive, whether slender, athletic, or with a bit of weight, depending on personal preferences. Positions and comfort. Experimenting with different positions can enhance comfort and experience. Finding the right position and allowing the receiver to have control over depth and speed can make a difference. Preparation and communication. Adequate preparation and open communication with the partner are crucial. Trust and consent are even more critical in anal sex. Professional consultation. If any health concerns arise or persistent discomfort is experienced, it is advisable to seek guidance from health professionals, such as doctors or sex therapists. Refractory period. Most men experience a refractory period after orgasm, during which they cannot have another orgasm. The duration of this period varies from one man to another and tends to increase with age. Refractory period. Most men experience a refractory period after orgasm, during which they cannot achieve another orgasm or immediate erection. The duration of the refractory period can vary widely among individuals. Relationship between pornography and addiction. Pornography addiction is a debated topic in the scientific community. Some people may develop a dependence on excessive pornography consumption, but not all consumers become addicts. Respect for personal values. Showing respect for the partner's personal values and beliefs is essential for a successful relationship. Safe exploration. Exploration of anal sex should be safe and consensual. It is always advisable to start gently and listen to the body's signals. Sex and creativity. Sex and creativity are related in various ways. 
Many artists and writers have found inspiration in their sex lives. The connection between artistic expression and intimacy can be a source of innovation and personal expression. Sex and laughter. Laughing during sex can enhance the experience. Laughter releases endorphins, the same chemicals released during sex, which can increase pleasure and intimacy. Sex and sports, regular physical activity can improve sexual function and performance. Exercise can increase stamina and blood circulation, often translating into better sexual health. Sex education varies widely worldwide. Some countries have comprehensive sex education programs in schools, while in others, sex education is limited or non-existent. Sex in the elderly. Sexuality in old age is an important part of life for many older individuals. Older couples can continue to enjoy an active and satisfying sex life. Sexual desire during pregnancy can vary from woman to woman. Some women experience an increase in desire due to hormonal changes, while others may feel less interested in sex. Sexual therapy is a form of treatment that can help individuals overcome sexual issues, such as dysfunction, lack of desire, or intimacy-related concerns. Sexual therapists are trained to address a wide range of sexual problems. Sexuality in Kama Sutra Culture, the Kama Sutra, an ancient Hindu text on love and sexuality, provides a detailed insight into sexual positions and erotic techniques. Despite its fame, the Kama Sutra promotes a balanced view of love and pleasure. Skin as a sexual organ, the skin is the body's largest organ and is filled with nerve endings. Physical contact, such as hugs and massages, can be highly erotic and stimulating. Smell and attraction. The sense of smell can influence sexual attraction. A person's natural scent, their pheromones, may play a role in sexual chemistry and attraction. Studies on the clitoris. Despite the importance of the clitoris in female sexual response, there has been a lack of research on this organ compared to the penis. However, there has been an increased focus on clitoral research in recent years. Take it slow. Successful anal penetration generally requires patience, relaxation, and the gradual incorporation of elements for a positive experience. The effect of light on arousal. Ambient light can influence sexual arousal. Some people may feel more comfortable and secure with dim lighting, while others prefer total darkness. The choice depends on individual preferences. The influence of pornography on expectations. Pornography can influence sexual expectations. It's important to remember that pornography is a fictional representation of sexuality and should not be seen as a standard for real sexual life. The relationship between sex and stress. Although stress can decrease sexual desire in some people, sex can be a powerful stress reducer. The release of endorphins during sex can help alleviate stress and anxiety. Time and patience. Anal sex requires time, patience, and gradualness. Rushing can result in discomfort or pain. Types of orgasm. Women can experience different types of orgasms, including clitoral, vaginal, and G-spot orgasms. Some women also experience combined orgasms involving multiple areas of stimulation. Variability in pleasure perception. The perception of anal pleasure varies considerably among women. Some may find it extremely pleasurable, while others may not enjoy it as much. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.